In this video, I'm going to show you step by step exactly how I myself was able to fix Roblox no network error on my iPhone. So if you're currently facing that error, well then this video is going to be perfect for you. What you're going to do firstly is going to be two steps by the way. The first step is going to be for you to swipe down right here as you can see. And then what you're going to do is to real quick enable the airplane mode. So enable the airplane mode and then disable it just real quickly. Because then what will happen is that your network will, will reset and you will reconnect to your Wi-Fi or to your mobile data, whatever you're using, and it will give you a stronger signal. And now, now you can try again. Probably this will not fix this issue for you the first part, but you can always try. And the second part is going to probably fix a lot of the issues that you're currently having. So what you're going to do is to just go into the App Store. So go into the App Store and we're going to search for Roblox in here. So search for Roblox and scroll down in here. And then as you can see, I have this update button in here, because if I'm trying to actually go back into Roblox, I'm going to show you, as you can see, I have to upgrade. So if you don't upgrade, you will not be able to basically enter into your Roblox app. So click on upgrade and then go back in here and click on the update button. As you can see, the blue update button, because if you don't update to the latest Roblox version, you will not be able to log in or you will keep getting the network error all the time. So just update to the latest version and then go back and try again. So as you can see, it's now loading for me. So I have to wait a couple of seconds for it to actually upgrade to the latest version. But this should be able to fix a lot of bugs that you're currently facing with the app. So I'm going to click on open right here now when it's done. And let's see if it actually works. It should be able to. Yeah, as you can see, it's now working. And that is basically exactly how to fix this issue. 